are ready to be picked and put in a pie for all our friends. Big of fire for short. Are you ready to get hopping? Yeah! Uh, that's this far. When you fly up into the tree, grab as many peaches as you can. Ah. Got it! Good ah. luck! made what's so great about us bunnies even greater. Which means we can make something that makes everything greater. What do you say? before I try it out again. Mm -hmm. These flowers are gonna make some great perfume, Caper. Uh-oh. Huh? Sneeze attack! Uh, uh, chill! <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like Brie and Twist. Break alert! Save! 
Peach, Caper, I have something I want to show you. Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> Funny, guys. Now, who wants to see my super duper enchantment maker? It makes a regular enchantment uh, super duper. Uh, we'll pass. What? It's just, uh, well, we know what can happen when you have a new invention. Well, this one is different. This is going to make everything in Wonderwood Forest easier. Just watch. <laughs> awesome! Those are some of my best smelling roses. Oh, these will make some amazing perfume. Oh, wait, not so awesome. Uh, can you stop that? Widget wheel. Hmm. Drill zapper. Yeah. Ah, nothing like a day of beauty. Uh -huh. <sighs> Patter, flap. Uh -huh. Want to see my latest updated invention? Ah, uh, you know we um love your inventions, <laughs> but we um we have to uh wash off our face masks and feather conditioner. Oh, that's perfect. I can help you wash it off. <laughs> Hit it, twist. Uh -oh. oh no. Oh, this was supposed to be our day of beauty, not our day of muddy, puddly wetness. Enough to the drawing board. <laughs> Oh, I understand. But don't worry your little polka dotted self. I'm here to help. <sighs> Hi, Danessa. Oh, hey, Bree. I'm not having a very good day. I'd love to help, but you'll have to get in line, because there's a lost ladybug here that needs help finding her family. <gasps> I can help with that. I'll use my super duper enchantment maker to make my bug finder enchantment work over time. This can't be good. Oh my. Ginormous pie could cheer me up today. Hey, Brie. I know. My invention was a failure. Are you here to get apologies? Nope. Not at all. It's our best smelling batch of perfume ever. Mmm. Smells nice. And that's all thanks to your making our roses all big and crazy. So, you actually liked my invention? And we had so much fun flying like kites, we wanted to remember it forever. Yeah, dee! Whee! Yeah, who knew rain and mud make the best mask and conditioner ever? And the Ladybug family had a beautiful reunion thanks to you. <laughs> Anytime. So I guess this means my invention wasn't a disaster after all. Well... <laughs> It's just that it's probably not a good idea to supersize any more enchantments. We're so lucky we can do enchantments in the first place. We don't want to upset the balance of nature. That's right. Hmm. I guess you guys are right. Dig the dark out. I and I! Mmm. <laughs> Except for pie. Pie is totally okay. Oh, oh, huge. Yeah. When we're all done, I'll show you my other new invention. It's called the Flawless Forest Sweepinator. Uh, uh -uh. Huh, guess they didn't like that one. Oh well, more fun for us. <laughs> Sprint 
likes to exercise after every meal. Sprint's motto is, if you look good, you feel good, and you are good. <laughs> Okay, Sprint. Right on the noggin. Yeesh. <laughs> concussion. <laughs> no concussion. No head trauma. Just a little teeny bump. What is that? <gasps> Look, a baby porcupine. Aww. A baby fell from his nest. Porcupines don't have nests, Sprint. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh! <laughs> nice hat! <laughs> huh? Uh-oh. I better get him back to the rescue center. And we'd better look for his mama. Sprint, since you found him, you should come with us. Okay. <laughs> don't you worry, little guy. I'm going to take care of you like you've never been taken care of before. I mean, if any enchantable can do with a baby, it's me. <laughs> Enchantimals, we're besties forever. <laughs> Please stop crying. Please. <laughs> I know. Maybe you're hungry. <laughs> Oh. oh, wait! I'll sing you to sleep. Rockabye Junior in the treetop. Even though porcupines don't have nests, the cradle will rock. When the bell breaks, the cradle will fall. And down will come Junior, quills and all. Junior in the treetop, even though porcupines don't have nests, the cradle will rock. When the bell breaks, the cradle will fall, and down will come Junior quills and all. <laughs> uh, oh, I know. Uh, how about a game of peekaboo? Peekaboo, I see you. Peekaboo, I see you. Peek uh, uh, where did you go? <laughs> Junior! <laughs> Good little porcupines do not climb windows. Hey, Danessa, I need your help. I have a blister on my foot that feels like it's the size of a pumpkin. <sighs> See? It's working! My latest nostril amplifier is tracking the mama's porcupine scent. Right, Twist? <laughs> and if that doesn't work, our good old-fashioned outdoor tracking skills will be the answer. Right, Flick? <laughs> Have you been tree-leaping again, Merritt? Hey, I'm a monkey. It's what I do. Okay, a little salve and it'll all be gone and... <laughs> Junior! <laughs> oh, Danessa, please help Flag with her knots. Mm, it looks like a case of naughty willatitis. Cough for me, Flag. <laughs> Porcupine. 
find scent with your tongue like a snake. What? Don't worry. We'll find that mama porcupine. <laughs> Just wait till Danessa gets a sniff of our latest perfume. Purple Potato Surprise. <sighs> the surprise is, it doesn't smell like potatoes. <laughs> huh. Still no answer. Huh. I'm a warm and nurturing deer. I'm a warm and nurturing deer. I'm a warm and nurturing deer. Aw, poor Danessa. Maybe Caper and I can help. I don't need any help. I have it completely under control. Yes, sirree. No help, no need. I'll do it, no matter what. <laughs> I think we should look in the trees. I think we should look in the bushes. Well, my idea makes more sense. Well, I like my idea better. Let's try it my way. But my way works, too. Uh, ah! Um, uh, how, how about a, a, a thunder enchantment? Huh? A finder enchantment? What a great idea, Sprint. <laughs> well, I'll have my moment. First, we need a porcupine quill. like iron filings to a magnet and be drawn to the mama porcupine. Follow that fluff. Come down. Come down. <laughs> Why won't you listen to me? You sure you don't want our help? I, I, I. Oh, yes, please. What should I do? Well, first thing, you're thinking like a deer when you should be thinking like a porcupine. Um, which means... It just so happens I know a thing or three about porcupines having once played a really funny practical joke on a family of them that involved a huge pie, fake whiskers, and a rutabaga! <laughs> 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 uh, <clears throat> anyway, it seems that porcupines love to eat bark and will climb high into the trees to get to it. So it's natural for Junior to want to climb, and if you'd let him do it, he'd be just dandy. You mean all the crying was because I wouldn't let him do what he's supposed to do? Uh-huh. Well, I was scared he'd fall. Well, that's what would happen to me if I tried to climb that high. That's because you're not a porcupine! <laughs> there! There she is! Who knew porcupines could climb? Come down, Mama Porcupine! We know where your baby is! <laughs> Okay, to Danessa's. <laughs> I guess you could say all's well if it doesn't get a quill. Little guy really grew on me. Oh, there, there. It'll be all right. Yeah, I I'm sure you'll feel better in the morning. Here, have a tissue. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? <gasps> oh, Sprint. Oh, look. Somebody lost a baby crocodile. I wonder where his mama is. 